morning and welcome to the Valley Hospital Auxiliary's Employee Branch Flag Day Honor Ceremony. I'm David Bohan, Vice President and Chief Development Officer of the Valley Hospital Foundation, and I'm also a member of the Employee Branch. This is the second year we are holding this Flag Day ceremony virtually, and hopefully the last. We have been through a lot since the spring of 2020, and together we will come out of the pandemic with hope and a renewed appreciation for the continued work of our Valley staff in caring for patients and vaccinating our community. We come to you from the hospital's beautiful Friendship Garden, which has once again been decorated with hundreds of American flags. Each flag honors someone special and benefits the Auxiliary's $3.1 million pledge to establish the pediatric section of the Emergency Department of the Valley Hospital in Paramus and helps to fund an endowment for Valley Home Care's Butterflies, a pediatric in-home palliative and hospice care program for seriously ill children. In the near future, we can look forward to hosting this event at our new 40-acre campus in Paramus, which will feature more than 12 acres of green space, providing a park-like setting for patients, families, and visitors. Even with the challenges faced over the last year, we are fortunate that construction was able to continue, allowing us to reach a number of project milestones on or ahead of schedule. The new hospital will provide first-class physical facilities worthy of our first-class institution and create a health and wellness destination for the entire region. On behalf of the Valley Hospital Foundation, thank you for joining us. Philanthropy helps Valley achieve a culture of excellence and innovation while keeping a primary focus on the health and well-being of our community. Your generous support of our initiatives, like the Auxiliary's Employee Branches Flag Day Ceremony, allows the hospital to provide unparalleled care with compassion, dignity, and empathy, and ensures that Valley can continue to grow and thrive for years to come. Now I'd like to introduce Audrey Myers, President and CEO of Valley Health System. Thank you, Dave. I'm delighted to be here for this annual tradition. Now, these are unprecedented times, and the Auxiliary has shown great resilience and creativity in planning virtual fundraisers and activities. While it may look different from in-person events of the past, the sentiment of this Flag Day ceremony remains the same. Flag Day is a time for us to come together and remember the heroic efforts of individuals and teams throughout our history. This brings to mind our doctors and employees on the front line who over the past 15 months stepped up and continued to provide the compassionate care for which Valley is known. And so many of you who supported our efforts with philanthropic commitments, parades, donations of essential PPE, and heartfelt messages to say Thank you. Flag Day also commemorates the adoption of the American flag as a unifying symbol and beacon of hope. And we now have our own modern beacon of hope, the COVID-19 vaccine. Since its arrival at the end of 2020, we have vaccinated over 140,000 community members and employees. We have faced a trying and difficult time virtual school, work from home, separation from family members and friends, illness, and the direct and indirect impact of COVID-19 on our family and friends. It is this vaccine that will enable us to emerge from this period of uncertainty and move forward towards a brighter and healthier future. I want to thank the Auxiliary's employee branch for coordinating today's ceremony to commemorate Flag Day here at Valley and commend their fundraising efforts to benefit the Auxiliary's pledge. Now please stand and let us together raise our flag. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming 
whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rockets redly the balls burst in gave proof through the night that our flag was still there oh say dost that star-spangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free and the home of the brave thank you for joining us once again for our virtual flag day celebration my name is Peggy Beecher and I am the chair of the employee branch of the Valley Hospital Auxiliary. I would like to take a moment to thank each and every one of you for your support. I would also like to thank Lynn Tampak, one of our very own, for volunteering to sing the national anthem for us. Thank you all for participating.